Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. I'm very excited for what we're going to be doing today because today we're going to be going no budget shopping at Sephora. I've done shop with me's at Ulta before but never Sephora so I'm so excited. I've seen so many people do this and I know that Sephora has some new releases. I know Rare Beauty just came out with their new body care line and I'm not sure how recent this is but I know Sol de Janeiro has like a new scent out and then there's also just some things that I need to repurchase so yeah a lot of exciting things I hope to find at Sephora today. But yeah if you couldn't already tell I'm super super excited so I will see you guys when we get there. Okay, so I'm gonna start off here in Summer Fridays. They really don't have a lot. They're like almost completely sold out of their blush bomb sticks, so I don't think I'm gonna get any of that. They have one more of their lip treatment product, so I'm definitely gonna get it. I really wanted to try the pink sugar one, but they literally don't have anything. It's so picked over. So I'm just gonna get this. This is the brand new Sol de Janeiro scent that I've been wanting to smell for the longest time. I know it's supposed to be a vanilla scent, but I've heard it smells like cake batter and I'm obsessed with the smell of cake batter. So I'm definitely gonna be getting one of these. All right guys, I'm here at Fenty Beauty and I'm looking for their lip products, their lip glosses. Okay, so I just found them. I've seen so many people talk about this on TikTok. Ew, some of the testers are like really disgusting, but I'm definitely gonna get one. I do really like this shade of it. It's called Fussy, so I'm gonna look for that. They have one more left right here, so I'm definitely gonna be getting this. I also really like this shade. It's called Mauve Wives. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but this one's really pretty as well. This shade right here is also stunning, but I think I'm just gonna go with Fussy. I've heard their foundations are really, really great as well, but I really don't need one right now, so I don't think I'm gonna get one. This is my favorite mascara of all time, so I'm definitely gonna get another one. I've also tried it in the waterproof one, but I definitely like the original better, so I'm gonna get this. I'm here at Rare Beauty, and I think I want to try one of these soft pinch tinted lip oils. This color right here in Happy looks really, really pretty, so I'm going to look for that. Is this it? Yes, I found it. I'm going to get this. They also have it in this shade called Wonder, which is also really, really pretty. And they have one more left in this shade. I honestly can't decide between these two, but I think I'm going to go with Wonder. I've also heard really, really good things about their highlighters as well. Honestly, I might just get one. I'm not sure. This is the new body care by Rare Beauty that I've been looking for. They have their hydrating hand cream, body lotion, and aerotherapy pen. This is the thing though that I've been most excited to find the body and hair fragrance mist. It's like a really cool mist. Oh, it smells so good. It smells amazing, so I'm definitely gonna get one. Okay, so I'm here at The Ordinary. I really wanted their multi or multi peptide lash and brow serum, but they don't have any more besides this tester. And they have a box right here, but it's completely empty. So yeah, I'm really bummed about that. I think I'm gonna get their hyaluronic acid. And my sister actually uses this and she swears by it. So I'm definitely gonna try it out. Also, Drunk Elephant is like completely picked over. They like don't have anything. Like there's just like nothing on this shelf up here. And then all they have here are like testers. So yeah, pretty picked over. So I'm really bummed that I won't be able to get anything. They actually have some stuff down here, but I already looked through everything and I'm not really interested in any of it. So I don't think I'm gonna get anything, but yeah. All right, I'm here in the benefit section. I'm definitely gonna get a blush. I've heard Benefit has the best blushes. I'm definitely more of a person who likes like the peachy blushes, so I think I'm gonna get this one. They have some more like pink and red toned ones, but I'm definitely a peach girl, so I'm gonna get this. This shade up here, Krista, I think it's called, is also really pretty, but yeah, I think I'm just gonna stick with this one. I might also try one of their bronzers because I've heard like a million people talk about their hula bronzers. I might just get it in the mini version to try it and see if I like it first. 
comment down below if you like their Benetons. I've heard really good things about it and also really bad things, so I don't think I'm gonna get it this time, but comment down below if you like it. All right, guys, so my basket is like filling up pretty quickly. I am gonna keep shopping though. There's still some things that I really want to get, so I'm gonna look for those. All right, I'm now here at Makeup by Mario. I've heard so many good things about Makeup by Mario, especially their um, soft sculpting bronzers. However, I don't see a ton in stock, so I don't know if we'll be able to get one today. And they're completely out of their soft pop blush sticks, like completely out. All right, I'm gonna swatch out their bronzer. Oh wow, that's super pigmented. That's really nice. I'm here at One Size. I've never tried anything from here before, but I'm gonna look around. This is their cheek clapper. It honestly looks really interesting and they do have a lot of them in stock right now. So honestly, I might get one of these. I've heard their setting spray is really good. So I might, oh, it's like completely empty, but I was gonna test it. Their lip snatchers also look really interesting. Like I love the packaging of them. They also have a ton of bronzers in stock as well. I really wanted to get this liquid blush in Chili, but I don't see it anywhere. I'm really bummed about that because I don't think I'll be able to find it. I'm here in the Tarte section now. I've heard some really good things about their concealers. Maybe I'll get one of their concealers. It says they're the number one concealer brand, so I feel like I kind of have to try one. Also, Too Faced has the best lip injections. They sting really bad, but they work really well. So if you're looking for one, I definitely highly recommend the Too Faced lip injections. All right, I'm here at Glow Recipe, and honestly, I'm not looking for anything in particular. I just kind of want to see what they have. I've never seen this before. This is their Guava Vitamin C Dark Spot Serum. All right, guys, we've added a few more things to the bag. I'm gonna keep shopping for a little bit longer, see if there's anything else that like catches my eye. But yeah, I'm really happy with some of the things that I was able to find, so yeah. Also, Charlotte Tilbury has the best highlighters if you're looking for one. They are kind of expensive, but they're really, really good. I'm here at Living Proof. I definitely could use some more dry shampoo, so I might just get another one of these. I've never tried this. This is their curl definer. They also have a curl defining gel, which looks really, really interesting. I actually have naturally really curly hair. I feel like a lot of you guys don't know that because I always straighten it. But yeah, I have very curly hair and I've never tried any of Living Proof's like curling products. So I might just have to try one out. I think I'm gonna get this. Okay, so I'm in the way section. There's really nothing in particular that I need from Way. I just recently bought their shampoo. This actually looks really interesting. This is their wave spray. Honestly, I wonder how good it works. Do you have it in stock though, so I might be buying that. They also have their volume spray, which I've also never tried. I've never seen this before. This is their scalp and body scrub. I kind of want to smell this. All right, I'm going to be smelling their body cream. Ooh, that actually smells really good. It kind of smells like coconutty and like vanilla-y. It smells really good. This is another one of their body creams that I've never smelled before. Ooh, this one's definitely like more florally. I definitely like this one better. But yeah, I've never tried any of their body creams before, but they smell really great. This is the Amika brand. I've actually tried some of their hair products before and I've actually really, really liked them. This is the one I tried. It's their Perk Up Dry Shampoo. I love how colorful their packaging is, but I don't think I'm gonna be getting this. This cherry lip oil looks so good. All right guys, so I think I'm finally done shopping. I got a lot, a lot of stuff and I think I'm gonna check out now. So yeah, I'll give you guys a haul of everything once I check out. Okay guys, I'm back from Sephora and I'm gonna give you guys a haul of everything that I got. This is the biggest bag I've ever gotten from Sephora, but we're gonna get into everything because there's a lot to get into. 
So the first thing that I got is the thing that I really, really wanted to get today. And that is the new Rare Beauty Spray Mist. That's what it looks like. This is a body and hair fragrance mist. I did smell this in the store and it smelled amazing. I don't know why going into it, I thought it would be more of like a vanilla, like warm scent. It's actually not. I don't really know how to describe it. It's just like really fresh. But yeah, I'm so excited that they had this in stock in my Sephora, so... Yes. All right, next thing that I got is the Summer Fridays Lip Butter Balm. When I tell you, every time I go to Sephora, they are always sold out of the Summer Fridays Lip Butter Balms. But they did have one more left, so I had to get it. And this is their Sweet Mint. And honestly, I'm not complaining. I'm really happy that they had this, so yeah. So then I got the new Sol de Janeiro Butter Balm. And this is their, I hope I'm saying this right, Cher Rosa. 59 fragrance and this smells amazing i smelled this in the store and it literally smells like vanilla cake batter which is my personal favorite scent ever and also like the consistency of it is so thick and like moisturizing and nourishing so i got it all right so i then got the rare beauty positive light illuminator highlighter it looks like that i'm gonna open this up so that's what it looks like that looks gorgeous all right, moving on. The next thing that I got is also from Rare Beauty. This is their Soft Pinch Tinted Lip Oil. And I got this in Wonder. But that's what it looks like. It's so pretty. Yeah, that's what it looks like. So gorgeous. The next thing that I got is another lip product. And this one's by Fenty Beauty. This is their Gloss Balm. And I actually got it because my friend said she tried it. And it's her absolute favorite favorite lip gloss i also got it in fussy heat oh my gosh it's so gorgeous that's what it looks like and yeah i'm so excited to try this out i ended up getting two mini benefit a blush and a bronzer i ended up going with the minis because i wanted to try them out first to see if i liked them before i got the full size i've heard really really good things about this bronzer so i can't wait to try it out and then i just got this blush in the shade peach in so next off, I just got the Living Proof Curl Definer. I'm really curious to see how this works. I've tried like the Living Proof Dry Shampoo before, but I've never tried any of their like curling products. So I got this. So then I got this Hyaluronic Acid from The Ordinary. It was actually my sister who told me to get this. She uses it every single night as part of her skincare routine. And she said she's seen a major difference in her skin. That's what it looks like. And I'm really trying to make my skin more healthy and really get back into doing my skincare routine every night. And sometimes just getting like really nice products like this just help me like stay motivated and want to do my skincare more. I already showed you this, but I got the Better Than Sex Mascara. This is one of my favorite mascaras. My all-time favorite is Telescopic. I have the waterproof one out right now. I'm actually wearing that today, but I don't know if it's just me. I like the original better than the waterproof one. And then lastly, I don't know if I showed you guys this, but I got two of the Paradox Prada mini perfume sets. I got these as gifts for some of my family members because I'm going to see them soon and I thought these would just be like the perfect little gift to get them. And that is everything that I got from Sephora. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you're not already yet subscribed, you should definitely hit the subscribe button. Just saying. But yeah, I had so much fun shopping at Sephora today. And as always, comment down below if there's any video ideas that you want me to do. And also comment down below what your favorite go-to skincare product or makeup product is because I love hearing your suggestions and yeah that's pretty much it for today's video thank you again so so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one